Hi guys, welcome to Sue's Quick and Easy Contest Edition. I have spring fever, I must admit. I mean, the weather around here has been like hot, like summer. And we didn't even have much of a winter around here. And so I'm thinking contest time, right? Okay, so this is something that I got a while back. There were these cute little 4th of July baskets, and no, I did not get this around the 4th of July of last year. I got this a couple months ago, and I had a good, really good buy on this basket. Not with all the goodies in it, but just the basket alone. I got two of them because it was a buy one, get one free sale. And I figured I would save it for the 4th of July. But since the weather's been so nice and so hot and I have spring fever around here, like... It's contest time. So here is what I'm doing for the contest. You, all you have to do is in the comment box say that you would like to enter and then you can basically say anything that you want. You can say, I want to enter and that's it. Or you can tell me your favorite spring things to do, your favorite spring recipes. What makes you think of spring? And what about spring is just exciting for you guys? Because you know, it is kind of exciting when the sun's out and it's just kind of gives you a feeling of renewal, I guess you could say. So, what I've got here is the 4th of July basket, and I'm going to do another one, you know, closer towards the 4th of July, but this is just my spring flame. So, anyways, all you have to do is enter, be a resident of the USA, enter, and uh, what's the other rule? Huh. Oh, enter before May 1st, because May 1st will be when I'm going to announce the winner and give away this gift basket. So let me explain a little bit about what I have in this gift basket. <clears throat> Some of you may know I've been fascinated with this international type of market around here called Ironman's Market. They sell foods from all different types all over the world, all different cultures, you know, it's a great store. I love to go in there and just look around and see the things that I've never seen before. That's what gets me excited. Getting out there, checking out new things, and bringing you the latest info. And you guys all probably know a little bit more about this type of stuff than I do, but I'm not very cultured. I lived in the same town for like 35 years, so I'm not real cultured. Um, <laughs> so anywho, this is what we've got in the gift basket. This is from National. It's a spice mix for chicken, rejmi kebab, and I don't even know what that means. It says barbecue on the side here. So this is one of the prizes, a box of this stuff. Then I have a box of tandoori barbecue masala. Then, okay, on my show a couple episodes back, I brought this to you. This is Salad Accents Orange Ginger. And these things are good. And they're low in carbs. They're 3 grams of carbs and only 2.5 grams of fat, so they're relatively healthy. They've even got a gram of protein in here. And only 45 mg's of sodium. These things taste amazing. I want to learn how to make something like orange seasoning orange ginger seasoning because I'd be putting that on everything chicken pork and you name it the whole pig if I want to this stuff is good so here these two things are in the basket as well and what we have here this is called bell puri I think that's how you pronounce it a mild spicy blend of crunchy chickpeas nuts puffed rice sun-dried potato chips with dry chutney mix this is called Pan Trapton. I can't pronounce any of this stuff. It's a sweet and spicy blend of potato sticks, puffed rice, nuts, raisins, and dried curry leaves. I'm assuming that these are just kind of like snack mix type things or, you know, you can put it on whatever you want, I guess. I don't know. I've never seen any of this stuff before, before I went to this market, so. And this was my favorite thing that I found other than the orange ginger salad accents. This was like really cool. It was at Iron's Market and it's burger flavored snacks. They're called UFOs. 
unusually flavored objects. And it even says that right here. And I thought that this was just like really cute and really funny. So that's going into. So I will, if you're the winner, and I'm going to draw names out of my basket, by the way. Um, if you're the winner, I'm just going to stuff this basket full of that stuff and try to do it in a neat, orderly fashion so they don't get all smashed and yucky for you. So it can arrive in one piece, in other words. So all the, subs all the, oh, you don't even have to be a subscriber either to my channel. You can be a non-subscriber, you know. So get your entries in by May 1st. Tell me that you're in, and then if you want to elaborate and tell me anything about spring or summer or just say hi or whatever, just get your entries in. In the comment box below, just say, I'm in, Sue. And if you're the lucky winner, you'll get this basket full of a bunch of stuff that's pretty yummy. Well, I don't know about some of the stuff. I've never tried it, but I know that these are yummy. And these are just, the other things are just mystery products and maybe you just want to give it away as a cool gift to somebody. Maybe you know somebody that knows about this stuff and how you use it and maybe they like it. I don't know. Maybe it'll just be a surprise treat for someone because it's unusual and this is not something you see every day. Whatever. But anyways, well maybe you do see it every day, but I don't see it every day. So enter my contest is what I'm saying. I keep blabbing on and blabbing on and my dog's just listening to me so nicely. She's so cool. So yeah, just enter by May 1st. Tell me you're in and you'll get this basket full of stuff. If you win. So I will be, like I said, I will be doing a contest um, right now and that one will end on May 1st and I'll announce the winners on May 1st or May 2nd. <clears throat> and then, uh, when it gets closer to the 4th of July, I have another 4th of July basket that I will fill up with some more different types of goodies, and I'll do a contest around the 4th of July. But